And now we turn to Ulster County, where Kingston Mayor Shane Gallo is working to create additional parking for proposed mixed-use development on North Front Street. Gallo has been in talks here with a potential developer of the site, which formerly housed a parking facility, to try to build a garage there. But the mayor says the 400 required spaces could prove too costly. Instead, he wants to see two nearby parcels redeveloped into multi-level parking garages using grant money. The original parking facility was demolished a few years back. And in other Kingston news, the Institute for Family Health said that it has reopened the OBGYN and Specialty Care Center in Kingston. The building at 1 Fox Hall Avenue sustained heavy damage following a flood and has since been closed this summer. Now, the Institute for Family Health runs six centers in the mid-Hudson Valley. And in Rosendale, a town court clerk allegedly sold close to $6,000 in fines and other court fees. That all according to the state controller's office. An audit released last week cited faults in the town's oversight of financial records that enabled clerk Trudy Harper to allegedly conceal the thefts. The audit, it covered the period from January 1st of 2012 to December 31st of last year. Harper is facing a charge of grand larceny. It is a felony, and the case has been adjourned to December 10th. The town of Rosendale is required by state law to file a corrective action plan by January. Well, that's going to wrap it up for RFL tonight and for this week. We'll see you back here on Monday at 6 p.m. Till then, everyone, have a great weekend.